Hello and welcome to DND RV Center in Helena, Montana. It's a beautiful day to take a tour of this 2018 Arctic Fox 25W four season travel trailer with a slide out. Now keep in mind here at DND RV Center, we sell an awful lot of RVs and the Arctic Fox 25W is one of our more popular models. So we do stock a lot of them at any given time. Uh, if you're looking at this video on our website on one of our 25W listings, it may not be of the actual listing you're looking at because we take one video of a 2018 and put it on all of the 25Ws that will come through. So make sure you're, if you're on the, on the website you understand that. The pictures that you're seeing on the website are of the actual unit you're looking at. We take individual sets of pictures for every unit that comes through our lot. We don't use stock file photos or factory photos or anything like that. So those are accurate. Uh, the website is ddrvcenter.com if you're watching this on YouTube or somewhere else. Uh, make sure you go to our website at ddrvcenter.com. We clearly price and very aggressively price all of our Northwood products as well as all of the RVs on our lot. You can see that there. There are no surprise fees or charges, no dealer documentation fees or any of that other nonsense that a lot of other dealers do. We just don't believe in that here. We uh, like our customers and we like to make buying an RV easy. So let's take a look at this Arctic Fox here. It has a full fiberglass front cap. Uh, makes it smoother, less chance of leakage on the front of it than, some, than the other way you can construct it with the cheap Phylon. You can see the rock guard, the spray on rock guard on the front of it. Just keeps it looking beautiful a lot longer, helps your resale value. Power tongue jack, really nice thing when you're hooking up and unhooking, just makes that process so much easier. Of course, it's got a propane tank cover like most trailers will have. This one has the 30 pound propane tanks underneath it standard. A lot of companies will put the cheap 20 pound tanks underneath there because most people will never notice it until they get it home. That's just not the way Arctic Fox does things. These are quality built. They build them from the frame up. They're really ruggedly constructed. They're not a lightweight by any means. They're heavier than most of the other brands that are out there, but they are four season. They are insulated well, and they are built right. Looking at this side, you see the gorgeous graphics. It was a graphic change for 2018. They're absolutely beautiful. It looks classy. Dark tinted windows of course these are dual pane windows these are the optional dual pane windows that's how we stock most of our stuff here at dnd rv center because that's how most people want it compartment door right here you can see it's got the slam latch which is the easy to use latch compartment door is one inch thick and insulated because this is a four season trailer they don't use some real thin cheap blow in compartment door fantastic pass through storage you can see right there it also has the really nice magnetic catches so all you do is that and there's no little piece of junk latch to break on you and let that door fall on your head while you get while you're in there getting some also with the slam latch you literally do this and you're ready to go walk on down this way you can see they got a really good light right here where you would be using um, uh, dumping sewage any of that kind of thing so they really think these things out and they make it makes good sense the way Northwood builds a unit it's very functional for the customer this has a mid-size slide on it it's not a super slide it's not a real small slide but you can see it's a very deep slide and it really opens up the interior of the 25W. One of the things these guys are fantastic at is outside storage. And here's a monster compartment door on the outside. And when you open it up, you have all these shelves. They are great at using space. It costs more money to put in this compartment door than to just leave it as a wall. But that's not how Arctic Fox builds trailers. They don't build it for the cheap price. They build it to build it the right way, the way they think customers are gonna wanna use it. Move around towards the back, you can see the windows are good size. At the end of the slide out right here, we have a nice size window that opens. Again, a lot of companies will put a window there, but they don't open. LED tail lights with backup lights. Something else you don't see on very many trailers, a backup light. So when you're backing into a campsite or, you're, or you get home and you're backing in, you got some light back there. Spare tire, that comes standard on the Fox. Doesn't come standard on every trailer out there, so you wanna pay attention to that. Outside shower. Rear ladder to access the roof for maintenance and inspections. Of course, it's got a nice size power awning, super easy to use. You'll love the power awning. Radius entrance door so it doesn't tear that awning while it's out. It's got the nice hybrid aluminum steps. Good wide entrance door with the entry assist handle, makes access very easy. You can see this is a four season unit. A lot of salespeople will tell you that their unit is four season, but if the manufacturer doesn't say it, don't believe it. If a salesperson says, yes, this is a four season unit, the next thing you should say is, show me where the manufacturer says that. And you'll have a lot of fun with most of those salespeople because usually they're not. Gorgeous, uh, gorgeous wheels, just looks classy. Now, right here is the water fill. That's an interesting thing to point out. The reason we point that out to you is because the water tanks on an Arctic Fox sit directly over the axles. 
So they can put in bigger freshwater tanks that way and it doesn't affect how the trailer tows because that weight is centered right over top of the axles rather than the very front or the very back of the trailer where all of a sudden you add all this weight for water. So it might tow one way heading out to a campsite and totally different coming back as you transfer that water to the holding tanks. Arctic Fox puts that tank directly over the axles. It just makes sense. We're gonna take a look inside this 25W. Again, this is a 2018 model and you are at D and a D RV Center, ddrvcenter.com. All right, well, welcome inside this 2018 Arctic Fox 25W. As you can see, you walk in and it is just a beautiful interior. It's very spacious, it's finished well, the colors are very tasteful. One of the things our customers comment a lot when they walk into an Arctic Fox is, it just feels better. It feels more solid. It feels better built than brand XYZ that we looked at yesterday. And that's because they are better built. They use better raw materials. They use better wood. They use thicker, denser insulation in the sidewalls, dual pane windows. All those things add up to a better product. There's not one thing you can say is just what makes an Arctic Fox an Arctic Fox. It's all of the little things put together that make it such a popular trailer today. So here in this one, we have the new optional trifold sofa. This is new, uh, just came up as an option here in the last couple of years. You got a variety of different sofas you can get in this model that would include some that look like theater seats that don't really make a bed. Uh, the old jackknife sofa to this trifold sofa. What we like about the trifold sofa is it folds out into a very comfortable bed for guests when you need it and it folds out very easily and it's not an air mattress so it's not going to leak and give you all the problems that air mattresses do it's a memory foam mattress that's very comfortable to sleep on so we've optioned for the trifold sofa in this one but depending on where at what piece of inventory you're looking at here on our lot or anywhere else you may not see that style sofa you can see lots of storage in the front of that slide out. It's a mid-size slide out like I mentioned outside. So it's not just a sofa slide like most companies build in this floor plan. It's a much longer slide out with a ton of storage. We'll get to that in just a minute. You can see though that that slide out really opens up all the floor space. So you got lots of room here to walk around and move through. If somebody's sitting on that sofa, it's no problem to walk by. You've also got the Dream Dinette in the booth here. That also will make into a bed if needed. So you can sleep a lot of extra folks. They've got the drawers underneath that for easy access to storage, something you don't find in a lot of the other cheaper brands on the market today. It just costs money, so they don't do it. Again, when, with Northwood, one of the things you'll see is quality raw materials. And so what you'll find is these cushions. The backs to the cushions are much thicker and denser foam than what you'll see on, on cheaper brands. Same with the seat cushions on the base. Many of them that you sit on, you sit on it for a minute or two and you're, and you're all the way down sitting on the plywood basically. With Northwood, they use a much thicker, denser foam, so it's much more comfortable to use this trailer. You've got the Jensen stereo. That's an important thing. Most companies are using a cheap stereo. These guys are putting in the Jensen stereo. The Jensen products are made for RV use. All the little connections inside their stereos are built better for mobile use, for bouncing down gravel roads, things like that. So it's going to last a lot longer than some of the cheap ones you see out there. Lots of cabinets. Down here, you've got the Jensen TV. Again, same thing. This is made for mobile use. Most of the brands today just buy the cheapest TV they can get their hands on. Northwood doesn't do things that way. We're going to spin around and look to the back. <clears throat> At the entrance, you can see it's nice and wide, very spacious when you come into this coach. So it's not a tight entry like a lot of the RVs that, that we have uh, and see on the market. You've got the Norcold fridge. This is the 10 cubic foot. Six cubic foot is what's standard in most RV brands today. Some of them will have an option for an eight cubic foot. This is the optional 10 cubic foot. So it's got a lot more fridge space than most of the RVs you're gonna look at around the industry. Microwave, beautiful cabinetry. One of the things you might be able to see here in the video is the radius ceiling. The ceiling is not flat. It's a radius interior. And what that does is just makes it feel larger in here. It's a much larger feeling interior, just opens it up. It's a more expensive way to build the trailer but it has a much nicer feel than when they used to build them with the flat roofs. Got the big 21 inch oven instead of the cheap 17 like most companies use today. Lots of drawers and cabinets, beautiful solid surface countertops, and lots of cabinets, or excuse me, counter space in this 25W. Has lots of cabinet space too. Got a skylight right there in the kitchen so it's nice and bright. 
Here in the main area, you have a power fan vent so you can circulate air, get cooking odors out, cool it down, whatever it is that you're trying to accomplish, um, you can do that. So we're gonna walk forward and take a look, moving up towards the master bedroom bathroom. Here's some of these closets and pantries inside this slide out. You can see the pantry space here is just simply amazing. If you wanna use it for pantry space or whatever it is that you decide you wanna use it for. Nice closet right here and more shelves that can be used however you want to, along with four drawers on the bottom. That's all incorporated into the slide out, so many brands wouldn't have that. You have a real wooden door to, to separate the bedroom, so there's good privacy in the bedroom. It's easier to see that radius ceiling here. You can see it looking up high. Um, you can see the headboard and the cabinets. You've got a nightstand on this side with a charging port down there. You've got plenty of room and shelves right there, so reading lights all those things led lighting of course is standard in here there is bedroom carpet there's linoleum through the main floor but bedroom here bedroom carpet here that's just nice when you get up in the morning uh, or in the night to use the restroom there is a, an entrance door to the bedroom right here there's also another power fan vent on this particular coach we've optioned these so you might not find that on every one of them but there's one there to cool down the bedroom um, really nice way to have it. Now here is the bathroom. It's an all-in-one bathroom design. This one has a pocket door coming from the uh, from the bedroom, so you've got privacy. If you come back from the living area, it's a nice wooden door, and there's plenty of room in here. You can see there's good room in front of the toilet. There is a heat vent in the floor of this bathroom, something you don't find in every bathroom in every RV. And then the Decent vanity space. It's a little tight on that cabinet, but it's got a good sized sink. They could have put a cheaper, smaller sink in it, um, but they didn't. They went the right way. They got a lot of vanity space. Uh, LED lighting again, and of course, a good sized shower that you can easily get a guy my size, and I'm 6'1", about 240. So great, great bathroom with nice, easy access from the master bedroom. So again, this is a 2018 Arctic Fox 25W four season travel trailer with a slide out. We are D&D RV Center. We are in Helena, Montana, right on Interstate 15 at the junction of U.S. Highway 12 and I-15. You can find us on the web at ddrvcenter.com, where you will find all of our inventory, lots of pictures, and very clear, aggressive pricing. We make it very easy to buy an RV here at D&D RV Center. You can call us at 406-442-8542. We appreciate your time. Thanks for coming by. We hope you enjoyed the tour of this 25W.